Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of Workers and Resources Soviet Republic, the Sputnik Challenge. My name is uh, Kaya Maya, and today we're going to start with an uh, apology. And uh, then I want to go uh, through the comments with that. And also, um, um, we, we are going to do stuff after that. We're going to build some stuff. Let's make this roundabout, not uh, a junction mania, like NEP suggested. Yeah, we need to do that, because this is not a roundabout. This is just a, a gathering of junctions. Um, junction Street. Uh, anyway, um, first, let's go into the comments. I want to uh, begin with Gregor telling me y yesterday, I like it very much when you, quote, quote, waste s some time to go th through some comments step by step. It brings the community closer together than I read in the comments or it has been mentioned in the th thread. I know it is time consuming, but if it not happens every single episode, then I'm really fine with that. And I have to tell you that you are a really great head of state. The kindness sh shown to even the silliest comrade with the warm thank you when they do their jobs right, finally make the future become bright. Comrades like Honecker, Chef, sorry, or Taito would have done better if they would have had the chance to learn from you. Well, thank you very much, Gregor. And to everyone, I want to say, I don't think going through your comments is wasting uh, my time at all. I don't see, I don't look at that at all. I, I, w uh, my ritual is I wake up in the morning, have some coffee, uh, uh, put my computer on and the first thing I do is read through your comments and there isn't a single day that there isn't a smile on my face. So that was just really bad wording uh, on my part for which I apologize and I do not look at it uh, uh, that way at all. at all. So um, that's what I wanted to sh sh um, say. What, what happens on my part is I have to, uh, in my head there has to be for some reason room to stutter and that makes that you uh, your head is divided by uh, a little bit of gameplay a little bit of stuttering a little bit of english not being my native language so that makes that sometimes i, I have a bad word but i don't ever uh, mean to be blunt or anything so that's what i wanted to 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 talk to you about uh, or, or tell you about that and i'm i'm i'm, I'm very happy that we're almost out of winter. So uh, only 10 days to go. Yay. Um, then for the comments. Uh, Tilemus said the heat pipes. The heat pipe plan was finished at the exact right day. Exciting. Yeah, it, it was. It was exciting. And uh, this makes the, uh, part of the fun. The vanilla radio station employs just 150 people. But is one of the biggest buildings in the game. It sure needs some work over. Hopefully this, this will be soon with version 0.9. The roadmap says small, medium and large versions of every building. Yeah, Th that's... Uh, I, I hope for smaller buildings of, e of every building, or only with the radio station. That would mean that the rating will, will be lower, because you need these kind of people to get a 70% rating. Can we... Uh, we have still 8% of no workplace, so it's, it's fine for people to work here, uh, I, I'm seeing. But what I would rather have is that we uh, invest some more into the gas power plant, because we are, we, we are waiting for concrete here as well, and here as well. And I'd rather focus them to provide the gas power plant first, because we, then we can make some money. And uh, today we're also going to put in the underwire... Um, Under underground uh, wire. Okay. Um, so yeah, I agree. Uh, the limbus to do do well. Uh, I, I don't think I would ever use a small radio station, but for the other building, yes, definitely, definitely. Frankie says, uh, "Wow, that's the ultimate level of micromanagement." I'm going to nominate you for the uh, for the next awards ceremonies. Impressed. Thank you so much, Frankie. Thank you so much. <laughs> Um, Adam says every uh, everything is looking ready for the winter. Everything is getting done. The volume of steel you must have used for all that oil stuff and electricity to power it will finally pay off and give you the foot in the door for the new coal city steel city that will sh surely come soon. 
I think building at least one more house each episode assigned to construction for the demand that will come. And so you, you, you'll be more ready to move uh, a few to the new city. In the meantime, the first city needs a little more for the people to, to keep them fat and happy. Yeah, I, I talked about this in the previous episode. We need to have more... Uh, culture and um, uh, probably an, an extra kindergarten and maybe an extra shop because it, it, it's, it, it, it's, it's getting a bit um, to the max now. I, I, I agree. But I think now the beginning phase of the challenge is done. Survive, become profitable and start to expand. Love the city and how everything looks and works. Keep up the great work. Thank you, Adam. Thank you. I, I hope I will. <laughs> Chris Tater says, uh, personally, I'm a big twangal, so I also think they can solve a lot of lo logistic problems to include long distance commuting. Yeah, I think so too, but I th I'm, I'm kind of struggling with the steel it would mean to go all to the way to the border, because we have to lay the train to the border, and uh, we are, it's getting a bit tight here to... Uh, but we can also lay it here. That would be very nice for these people. But my uh, grandfather used to li li live three, three meters from a, from the main uh, train line to Utrecht. And so whenever a train would pass by, all the cups and saucers would start tingling. Uh, so anyway, um, Katip says, are you plowing asphalt roads or just gravel? I'm plowing all roads here. Um, um, this is a uh, gravel road, but not asphalt, but, th but this is gravel and this is asphalt, but you're right, I should put this to asphalt as well, I should put, put this to asphalt as well, and here I am doing all kinds of roads, but this, this wasn't, it, it is put to gravel, but it just doesn't plow here um so this summer i think I'm, I'm just going to upgrade this to asphalt and that should be the, the solving the issue i hope gravel road asphalt road yeah and also cheap um um you said here about the uh power power thingy um as you said, sorry about that. Uh, better safe than sorry. Better check twice than to not check at all and have to all, all, go, all go down to um, you know what. Um, so um, Adam said, um, can you show your finances at the end, please? I will. Might be useful to see what expenses you are spending on at what. Still thinking how much or how little it might cost to build a farm with food and booze factories which would lessen input and diversify just for export it won't make you lots of money but it will save you more and also give you a little more security yes 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 on the on the top of the two new mega city uh, iron coal steel and everything else production i think that um if i look at our um what we are spending money on i'm i'm now uh the import Food is a big, big, uh, the biggest, except for construction, uh, cost post. Um, that also would go with export because we have only 779 food we have exported. So what does a food factory uh, do per day? 20 tons of food. So this would be like uh, 30 days, 40 days in a year. So the rest you could export if you create uh, big farming areas so that could be very profitable um, uh, and you can also uh, create meat out of that and alcohol uh, which what, what 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 is the meat thing um, oh I, I'm going at, at the end of the episode I'm going to uh, look at uh, give you uh, insight on the stats also should I do this for the this year or this month or all uh um yeah so meat is also pretty high alcohol well we're drinking 
Okay, so th th this would f for the last four years approximately, it would be 200, uh, 230, 240,000, which you can then also. I, I don't think uh, it's viable now, but it's definitely a good idea to work towards two. But I do also think you can only work towards one thing at this moment because our, our, we, we just don't have enough um, uh, bandwidth for that. Um, is concrete being delivered here now or uh, because I would really love to see that? You're doing nothing. Why? You can't produce concrete. Uh, let's see here why. Because we don't have any cement. And cement is coming. Okay. And then uh, let me see. Yeah, there's more concrete than we started here. Okay. So uh, we're, we're actually just waiting for cement here. Okay. Then uh, uh, Frankie says, who needs a radio if you can have access to this fabulous channel? Just a second, the phone is ringing. So that was the phone uh, ringing, sorry for that. Uh, wh where was I? I was, uh, well, first of all, I need to press play again. Uh, play. And then to the comments and uh, to another window and close this window. Okay, um, Frankie says, P.S. Who needs a radio if you can have access to this fabulous channel? Thank you, Frankie. Thank you, Frankie. I wonder why the trucks are y y using still the mud road parallel to the Finnish asphaltization road from the border. Well, because uh, the big trucks are going 38 kilometers an hour. And so they are choosing to use the mud parallel road because that's closest to their actual speed. Only the mud road is not being plowed, so I need to remove that road. That's that's uh, or, or, or I think I already did now. Yeah, I did now. Sorry. Yeah, yeah, I did it in the in the last episode because because of this. Uh, now this part is plowed. Um. Don't know, don't know. Um, so thank you so much, Frankie. That was a really endearing comment. Thank you very much. Adam says, I still can't believe it's only 1963. Yeah, we're, we're, we have, in the meantime, we're just in 1964. Yeah, we are, are um, oh, we have oil almost done. Um, because what's happening here? Uh, where are we? Well, boards are being brought in. Look, look at all the uh, all the things that are being brought, and we are we can uh, import steel, so we can finish these buildings. So let's do that. Um, we have we have fifty eight tons. Oh, oh, because we we don't have enough open holes. We don't have to import steel, not even. So that's that's great news. So, wait, maybe we can spend 30,000 on, uh, on a big oil tank. Because we, at some point, also need to hold the oil there. But, what are we going to do? Well, um, you know, there's one thing which I haven't, and that's what we should spend the money on. We don't have any people working at, at our fire station. We don't have any firefighters here. Oh yeah, we do have two, but no people. So yeah, let's do that first before uh, something catches fire. And well, you know, uh, so I'm going to press pause and uh, let's see. Um, how many people? 20 people, right? Working there. Where am I? Here. Um, 20 people? 24. So if I divide it by four trucks, five hours. And to the, I think that would be fine. So, uh, trucks, let's, let's transport people in buses. That would be better, I think. And uh, also, with you are seven. I am thinking of using these and maybe, maybe um, replace some of these buses. So, have, have some more of these buses for the construction offices. Yeah, let's do that. You don't have anyone transported. No. No. Okay. So you uh, go. Where's my 
depot here, here. You go to the depot. You go there. You go there. You go there and press play. And now say, uh, well, get your workers. No, I want the boss. <laughs> Uh, why? Because I'm afraid that now the fire station will catch fire right when I'm making this. Um, you know that's happening then. Right when I'm making this route. So get out. Get in. Get out. And get to the... To there. Okay. Don't go there. Copy this to uh, this vehicle. Okay. We're lucky that they're in the vicinity. And don't don't go uh, to the to you. Oh, don't go. So that means that we are pretty in luck. Yes. Uh, and don't go there. Let's zoom out. And now we can press play. Because you are all going. Yeah, you are all go going to the bus platform. So that's nice. How are we food wise? 11. I'm happy. And hey, the, the, this is a pretty good food situation to be, I think. Or to have. Um, can we... Where is the cement silo thing truck? 12 tons. Oh, it's close. I planned. So, um, I've been looking at the rules for the Sputnik challenge. And uh, because I don't like that I can not uh, buy v vehicles anymore which are not in their production year. Or the, the, the not the production year, but the year that, that they are available. But the rules say, uh, let's go to the settings. Uh, we can also uh, lock according to a uh, starting year. And so that would mean these vehicles are available. And uh, I'd like to do that because... Um, uh, yes, I'm sure. Okay, so now we can kind of uh, buy our beloved these vehicles again, things like that. Yeah, I think that's better. So, what's next? I wanted to uh, create the power line here, which in the last episode we saw that the underwater power line would be enough. At least I saw, and I, 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 the episode hasn't released yet. So, oh yeah, it, it, it did release yesterday. Sorry. So, um,. Going from here. Oh yeah, we had this issue, yeah. Okay. So how are we going to tackle this? You. Okay, we're going here. Where are we going? Here. I think I'm going here. And then I'm going to go down. Going up. Where is it? Up is Q. Okay. We're, we're doing nothing here, apparently. We're staying here. Staying where we are. And go up. 57. No, no. Oh. 820. I think this is fine. Just uh, uh, do your thing. You are not, uh, no. Okay. So, uh, then we need to buy some new, new vehicles here, right? So, with the, yeah. Uh, because uh, we need some more. These pieces, uh, 652. Um, let's say bus. Let's say total capacity. And this is uh, 4,000. Four of them, I think. Okay. Excellent. One crane here, one crane here, one crane here. We, we might want to, in the future, might have an extra with these four, a third free construction office or something. Maybe, maybe, maybe. So, um, then... Um, I want to talk to you about Flair and about Jennifer Aniston, who didn't get any. 
Um, last episode, I talked to you about that, and let's let's kind of look. And I, I've been really going back and forth what to do here. What's what wisdom? So uh, again, uh, a small flare here. Um, it's um, ten ton steel, and uh, it uh, it consumes three uh, maximum of three tons bitumen, and it brings you literally nothing. Uh, where the uh, oil bitumen upgrading plant is 45 tons of steel, but it it uh, it can do 10 tons of bitumen, where our uh, re refinery has a maximum production of 15 tons, but it's 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 better than the flare, I think, because for 10 tons you would already need three flares, which is also 30 tons of uh, steel. So I think I want to put this one in uh, to get rid of the bitumen and to have some extra fuel. And then we're going to have a whole lot of crisscross piping here. I'm going to explain to you why uh, F1. Because I, I... Oh, no. So, uh, output is there. How much do you pollute? 15 tons a lot because the Hibbert refinery only has 2.4 so yeah uh, not here probably here no how about like this um yeah I want it a little bit further, to be honest. So I can make my corners. Like so. Okay. This is actually the... Or do I... I, I want to have a level right away. So, uh, groundworks. Do your thing, please. Do your thing. It's March the 1st. Are we still not? Well, how long do, do you need? Um, why are you not? No people. Why are you missing cement? Oh, I am. I am. Um, because you just. Started producing a bit and now you're already out, probably. I missed that. So, uh, maybe we need for these kind of constructions an extra cement uh, delivery uh, vehicle. Maybe not. Where are you now? Okay, um, talk about this. We can. Yeah, let's do that first. Let's, let's, uh, le let's make th th this road concrete now. Because that needs to happen. Also, I want to have another... Uh, leave it here. Buy another uh, dry bulk tank. What is your total capacity? You have 20 tons. 60. 47. 65. Buy you. Also a blue one, I think. Okay. Then we need to have a side road here. And then I want to have uh, 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 the same construction office again. Because that worked quite well in my opinion. Okay. Okay, uh, let's set up the construction office first. Um, uh, what to do? Where to put it? How are how, 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 like so? Um, yeah, I think I'd, I'm just going to put a free construction office here for now, which or I can use this. 
construction office. Because this is... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can use this one. Okay. Now. Gravel you... Or... Uh, asphalt it is. Okay. This, 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 I did do this in one piece. Hey, yeah. I didn't check that. <laughs> well. Um, you. Did you see this road? 152. Oh no, auto search is off here. What's, what is road 150? Oh yeah, that's the short road. Yeah. And I'm going to give you a high priority this time. Will this... Wait, wait a minute. Will this interfere with other constructions? Because... Uh, here we need concrete, which, are, which, which is this construction office. And here we need concrete as well. Yeah, I don't think... Maybe it does interfere with this construction. But I rather have... I rather have uh, groundworks, groundworks. Yeah, that's... Put you both on high priority, I think. Yeah. So, um, let me see. How are we doing here? Still going back and forth. Four, three. We're almost finished in the tunneling phase. Almost there. How much steel do we have? How much steel do we have? Do you hear my excitement? Because finally oil. Oil. <laughs> Um, so what I wanted to do today, uh, maybe I want to uh, beautif beautification a little bit. Because we, we actually we need to wait now for uh, the various buildings to be finished. So, yeah. But no. Yeah, we, we can do this a little bit. A little bit. So, uh, first of all, this roundabout I've been waiting to do for a long time. Uh, 78, so we are increasing. Oh. Always have to wiggle it a, bit, a little bit. Maybe bigger. No, that you won't do this here anymore. Okay. Let's zoom you out a bit. For me, this is the relaxing I always start, when, when I do this, I always start how this is. So, uh, you, you have this Reddit, oddly satisfying. And uh, th that, th that is what this feels to me. It's only small, and uh, we can upgrade these roads as well, right? Go. Go. Oh, yeah. Okay. This is really going to make a change, a, a difference, I mean. I'm going to do this right away with you. This gas power plant. We need to... Oh yeah, I, I am going to elaborate on all the pipelines we're going to have to lay. Because the gas power plant I probably would want to lay right away. Do I have uh, everything assigned to you? Yes, you are working. Excellent. Maybe some trees in the city. Because it's treeless now. And it's... It's like uh, very barren, and trees make such a huge of a difference. So you go away. Okay. 
here a little bit. You and then for the road. Oh, here, here, here. It's a bit finicky every, every time. What I do, and this used to be a lot of work. Uh, let's let's look. It doesn't get the road if you just go over it. So I make it a bit smaller and go. You know the re red dots. It has to go right beside the road, and then it will get these areas. The other way around, it works the same. And going up, up, up and down usually fills it in a bit more let's just do the first part of the road here we're getting some cement which is excellent and that rhymes wasn't even my intention wouldn't it be nice to have uh, we are going. I believe we ha we are going to have to create our own electrical components for the monument. And then we can also upgrade these roads to have lights. So until here. And the rest I'll probably do later at another touch up. Uh, like there are these. Uh, these small areas no you don't want to okay that's your prerogative Maybe going back and forth like this. No, it doesn't fill everything, but most of it. So let's see how that kind of pans out. Trees. I was talking trees. Mm. How much steel do we have? Can we? We have 40 tons still and we are getting some money again. So would it be an option to kind of start crime and justice now? Real. I think we can do this. I would like that. First, uh, this part. Not a secret police yet. Yet. To you too, I think. 16 tons of steel. Let's do this one. This is three. Um, oh, this is a whole other ball game. 19, 20. Yeah, let's let's start you first. So, um, are you getting steel? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Excellent. So, uh, suddenly we are doing crime and justice. Well, part of crime and justice. The reason I want to hold on is because I want to. This secret police means that we have to change all our settings here. Uh, um, um, loyalty, uh, loyalty wise, because now no one, let's, no, no one is looking at this, uh, level because we don't know what loyalty is. And when, uh, the secret police is coming into action, then all of the sudden, uh, we know the lo loyalty and it could be that 55%, no one will be working here anymore because they're not loyal enough. Um, so how ma how many apartments without uh, 42, 36? Shall we add another one, like suggested? Um, maybe. This is all, maybe. Let me also see that I... Uh, oh, I'm doing this again. I'm doing this again. Go away. Yeah, but uh, we we are getting uh, concrete here, and this is 
actually getting started now. So now I'll my here. Okay, let's first take a look at the road. Um, something being done here? Yeah, 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 yeah. Shall we add people here? We don't have any un unemployment. No, because because this this one uh, because of this. Oh, do I have people from outside here? No, no, no. Okay, okay, excellent. Hmm. I think we might be pretty good idea to add buses there to have it a little bit quicker. Medium then. So, how is our oil doing? Are you done? Almost. Hi. Same, almost. Hi. Okay. We need... Um, Uh, buh, 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 um, <laughs> um, what are they called again? Oil tanks here. And um, um, what's the capacity? 30,000. 15 tons uh, they have as a storage. Uh, you can go 75. 14 tons, 13, 15, 9, 4,000 extra. I would, and the, I think I, this is, I'm going for you. 12, 15, yeah. Uh, I think 2 for now. How much is that? 20. Yeah. So how is our production here going? Are you... Uh, quite alright I think. Oh! What am I doing? My window just <laughs> decided to uh, evaporate into thin air. Um, so yeah. Um, I want to see Hopefully in this episode it, this will be finished. I didn't assign a crane, did I? Okay. That would have been... Um, cranes and buses. I even didn't assign a crane here. If you, ha if you set up your construction office like this, use them. Use them. Um... So, uh, hulls, and then I would like to assign you here. Uh, just go away. Uh, you here. You here. And you there. And uh, maybe I'm going to... I'm, I don't know. It's a bit the, the, uh, big for now. So, maybe they can still help a bit. Um, you go there. You go there. So, are the cranes going? You can... Um, don't you have fuel? You have fuel? Oh. Why aren't you going? Because I didn't assign you. Um. I thought I did. Uh. Oh. It's already complete. <laughs> okay. So that means that uh, you are creating oil. Look at, look at the speed. We're probably going to need more trucks here. So, let's set you up. Um, it's 
could even be that it's going to be a line or something. You uh, load there. Load there. Unload there. You can unload to... Uh... So we have a 12 ton. How much is 12 ton? That is... Uh, how about... If... How about load at 60%? Sixty percent of fifteen is like uh, start loading when there's nine tons, because we need more uh, vehicles. That's uh, pretty obvious here. Pretty obvious. It's going pretty fast, which is great news. So where are my? Uh... Cisterns. Well, here they are. Yeah. How are you going? Are any people here? Any people coming? No, it's not a high enough uh, priority, I think. Okay. So that would also mean that I would like to have uh, you. You are going to load fuel now, which is fine. But I am wanting you, to be honest, to start working here. Or do we have a separate distribution office? I want to have a separate distribution uh, office for that, to be honest. Distribu uh, where are you? Distribution, distribution, here. Do we have a free one? No. Uh, can we ha can we remove one here? You are doing nothing, right? So you go away. The three sisters becoming the two sisters now. Remove you. And uh, I want it still to uh, have you. Um. So for the oil, I'm going to add you as a distribution office here for now. Uh, you. F1. So. So. Um, you, you. Okay, I not noticed. So the um, oil tank is going to work here. There. And uh, then we are going to add a task. Like if you are too full. And how full are you now? Well, like 30%. 30%, that would be more than 100 tons that can be exported. Then you can go to the border and unload. Uh, all my uh, storage is done. Oil. And also, if here... Uh, hold on. Because I don't want to... <laughs> I don't load... Oh no, it's fuel. So fuel and export fuel. Do you have... No, you don't have any... No, no, go play. Um, and so, here, if this is 30%, 30% is a lot, or even 20%, even 10%, to be honest, because that's also 100, already 125 tons. And that you can unload here, this unloading, uh, and you can uh, store oil and go to 100%, and then uh, rename refinery oil storage and uh, this oil storage is going to be called uh, how do you call these again these ones oil, oil shore 
hard word to say. Oil your storage. Okay. You can say that. Oil shore storage. Okay. So. That would mean that um, you should be doing stuff. But you're not. Why is that? Um, fuel. 30%. Probably not 30%. 20. Yeah. Let's export some fuel. And after this, 30%. So we have some money. And then we can maybe buy an extra one. So, uh, I did buy two, right? Yeah. I think we can add you. Because you're also already full. So, uh, just remove you. And add you. Add you. Load. Unload. To a hundred percent. Hurry up! Hurry up! Twenty fourth of March. And uh, we can uh, provide you with fuel, hopefully. No. Fire station. Well, you are going to have to get your fuel from there then. Oh, I'm already assigned. So you are already having fuel then. Oh, well then we're going to assign the hospital again. And go up. Add hospital. I'm not. Okay, excellent. So you are going to load oil when. Yeah, you are. You are doing stuff. Go, hurry up. We can add some of, this, of these side roads again. I had to uh, uh, upgrade this one. I forgot. And I don't. I don't want you to do that here. This is not uh, how I intended it. I intended it to go there. And uh, to a hundred percent. So, are you? We have five parties. We are protected. And I think I'm going to leave it at this because. Um, I'm very excited we have oil. Maybe two vehicles are enough. Maybe not in winter, but how much do we have? 25 already. 11,000 there. Um, we uh, are having uh, some fuel on the way and you are on the way. So uh, fuel is getting there. How much is that? 10,000. What are you doing? Oh yeah, you are going to the to the uh, to here. How oh, are are there people working? There are people working. Excellent. So uh, it's seventy eight percent happiness. Next episode, uh, how's our crime and justice? You are done. Let's let's disassign you for now. We need another distribution uh, of uh, until you are done. you on high okay thanks for watching this episode Elves being uh i won't stop uh, uh, doing this actually Ex excellent i hope to see you next time adam i'm not forgetting you uh i'm going to uh, open the um, i think i'm going to do all and uh for the next 10 seconds i'm uh, going to uh, look at this bye bye